Esme, a world-renowned hacker with a penchant for rescuing stolen art, thrived in the shadows of the digital world. Tonight, her target was a notorious collector known as the Raven, rumored to be holding a priceless Viking artifact. Esme, codenamed Ghost, infiltrated his heavily guarded mansion with ease. Reaching the vault, she was about to deactivate the security system when a dark figure materialized from the shadows. Tall and intimidating, with eyes like molten gold, he radiated a danger that went beyond mere security guard. Before Esme could react, he lunged, pinning her against the wall. But instead of gruff threats, a disarming chuckle escaped his lips. Caught red-handed, little ghost, he purred, his voice a smooth velvet. Esme, never one to back down, met his gaze defiantly. They were locked in a silent battle, hacker versus protector. Then, a glint of recognition flickered in his golden eyes. You're the one who exposed my father's corrupt business dealings, he breathed. Esme's surprise must have shown because he explained, he wasn't the Raven's goon, but his estranged son, disgusted by his father's crimes. His real name was Caius, and he too sought to right his father's wrongs. A risky alliance formed. Caius, a former special forces soldier with a knack for bypassing physical security, and Esme, the digital phantom, worked together. They disabled the vault, retrieved the artifact, and escaped under the cloak of a moonlit night. As dawn approached, they stood on a rooftop, the artifact gleaming in the first rays of sunlight. This wasn't just about stolen art anymore. Esme had found a rare vulnerability in Caius's stoicism, and he, a grudging respect for the enigmatic hacker. Until next time, ghost, he said, a hint of a smile playing on his lips. Esme winked. Until next time, shadow. Their paths would inevitably cross again, a thrilling game of cat and mouse fueled by a shared sense of justice and a spark that neither of them could quite place, but one that shimmered brighter than any stolen treasure.